Back when I was very young, three men came to my village talking of packing one chip challenges, talking of riches, talking of kingdoms, talking of spice kings. Not a prince, not a queen. My kingdom for a thousand years. Some men just want the kulos. How's it going, universe? Welcome to Zoo Box. I'm Sean. I got Big Paul and past and future guest Dan Prophet. We're all here. We've come together. We've come together to settle, to settle something, to settle something. Who truly wears the crown of Spice King for Zubox, for Zubox channel? Okay, I've seen some people do some crazy shit. I've seen some people. I've seen people do some crazy shit lately, like eating like six of these, like fucking maniacs. We're not quite that advanced. We're not ready for that. We are. We are of a smaller kingdom, but don't worry. We're gonna get there, and we're gonna take over that 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 place. And we're gonna steal that guy's wife, and she's gonna be ours. You're like one of the. Like- <laughs> One of the many kings of Gaul before Julius Caesar came in, and they had to like unite everybody. We're, yeah. We all have our tiny little kingdoms, and tonight we're going to find out who actually gets to fight and lose to Julius Caesar, aka Cam the Spice King. <laughs> <laughs> so that's right, everybody. We're going to be doing the Packy One Chip Challenge, the 2021 edition. Oh my God! So um, I watched a bunch of videos last night. Well. For whenever you watch this, you can go back and watch a nightcap. I watched a bunch of videos trying to kind of just gauge the experience. Mm. You know, you get like it seems like it just goes from one extreme to another. There's some people just eat the chip, they kind of sit there for the five minutes and they're fine. Other people lose their fucking minds. And there seems to be like no rhyme or reason to it. You see people that are very, oh, I'm a spice king myself, very experienced. They have a bad time. Randos on the street, they, they handle it okay. So it doesn't seem like there's really any rhyme or reason. Maybe it's due to the manufacturing of the chip. Maybe the Spice King himself has some explaining to do. Is there inconsistencies in the way these things are produced? Are we all getting the same chip, Spice King? Don't fuck with me, buddy. Don't fuck with me. I got a fucking knife. It says Dad on it. I got a hot chip. Fucking, I'm already heated. I'm already heated. I'm getting already violent. Heated, <laughs> <laughs> they even have a video of an 11-year-old girl doing this chip challenge. So, I mean, you know, who knows? Who knows? Sick fucks. That's like that's akin to s- child sex trafficking, in uh-huh. my opinion. That's what that is. That's like a millionaire. Like, make her eat another chip, please. Eat the chip. Eat the chip. <laughs> I need like, to come. This is how I come. <laughs> like like there's some like Saudi and uh, Saudi Arabian prince yeah. that yeah. orders like a girl from Malibu from Instagram to come over. And, and Where like, am first, I? She has all oh of my her God, bro- are you a fucking prince? He has all of his brother's shit on her, and then he makes her eat a bag full of one chip challenge chips. <laughs> she chips all over herself. Eat the chip, inshallah. Yeah. <laughs> oh, you. Oh, the, the flame's too much, huh? Here, have some fucking oat milk, uh, you stupid bitch. Uh, if any That's of you people, uh, if any of my, if any of the normies are watching right now, we're not exaggerating. No. Was, that literally That's, happens all the time. That happens all the time, like every single day. Yeah, some uh, there's there's an American girl getting pooped on by a goat in Saudi Arabia right now for like fifteen thousand dollars, and it's money well spent if you ask me. Yeah, she you deserves know, it. The saying, yeah. you gotta, you know what I'm saying? It's like Britney Spears says, "Got to better work, bitch." Yeah, she's you the want infidelity. a Maserati. You want goat shit all over you? This is what this is what you have to do. This is how you achieve these things. Yeah, still People the think work. success still just comes easy. People think these things they should just be given things. I don't think so. No, 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 no. Sometimes you have to go to Saudi Arabia and let goat shit all over you for fucking fifteen thousand dollars. And if that's the price, that's the fucking price. All right. So now anyone who who we haven't lost. Uh, <laughs> I know we just like front load it with this awful shit. We never actually do the challenge. We just keep <laughs> escalating the scenario. Actually, I bet you Britney Spears herself would go down there and get shit on for fifteen thousand dollars. But she doesn't if, even need. Uh, she's just sick like that. If Max Martin would have told her to do it in nineteen ninety eight, she would have, and that's the sad. Yeah. Truth. 
fuck yeah, dude. Max uh, Martin, whoever, whoever, whoever made that one night in Paris video, it would all be done in fucking like infrared night vision. Very, <laughs> very unsettling. <laughs> oh boy! All right, all right. So let's open up the boxes. Yeah, I think we, we should here. we should do like an unboxing for the crowd. They should yeah. see. Yeah. So when you unbox it, this is what it comes. This is what it looks like. I got the chip here. It comes with uh, what to expect. Oh boy. <laughs> what to expect. There's all these different levels of experiences. The spike number one, the spicy punch, round two, the scorpion sting. Round three, vision disruptor. Round four, gut slash, round five, roasted. One thing that I like to point out about this at the top, it has like a uh, power meter for you and the scorpion. <laughs> And the scorpions is almost full, and yours is almost empty. Yeah. So, this like, is... right at, even right at the beginning of the challenge, you're like gonna get your ass whooped right out yeah. of the game. Yeah. yeah, you're you're and right here. I want to put on the back of the box too. Faced Reaper. Any last words? Rules for the challenge: Eat the entire chip. Wait as long as possible before drinking or eating anything. Post your reaction on social media with hashtag One Chip Challenge and mention Pakul Chips. And and that one right there at the end is how you know this is a psyop by the Chinese government to get all of our facial recognition, <laughs> and and to see our pain tolerance so they know who to target first. That's well, true. Well, speaking yeah. of the CCP, we just set up an app with that fine institution, and you can check us out at, at underscore <laughs> zoo underscore box. Like yeah. when 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 I go in to kill a group of pigs, I usually want to kill the smartest, most wily or violent ones first. And that's what the Chinese government is going to do to us. And that's the data that they're harvesting from apps like this. this well, this is, is I mean, I want to so throw it out right now. We even started this shit yet, man. I, I know, I'm, 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 this is I a think vibe. We, I got to say it right now. I challenge Xi Jinping to a fucking debate. What? To a fucking we got to eat. No. A, we got to eat a packy one chip challenge while no, we debate you put that about out human post. rights. While we debate about human rights, wake up, people. That's deep, man. That's deep. Fucking Xi Jinping. I'm coming for you, buddy. This right. one has a warning on the back. Do not eat if you are sensitive to spicy foods, allergic to peppers, and nightshades, or capsaicin. Which, by the way, I want to mention, if you're allergic to nightshades, you're probably at the end of the evolutionary ladder. I apologize. <laughs> uh, if you're pregnant or having any medical conditions, keep out of reach of children, uh, unless you're the spice king, and then intentionally feed it to your child for TikTok views. Um <laughs> After touching the chip, wash your hands with soap and do not touch your eyes. That also counts for if you get a hooker. Um, sensitive air. Uh, seek medical attention should you experience difficulty breathing, which I have my inhaler with me tonight. Okay. And fainting or extended nausea, which I'm probably going to experience right here on stream in front of everybody. <laughs> yeah, I think we're all going to be experiencing a little extended nausea. You're yeah. next. Oh, shit. Oh, ominous. Shit. Ominous. Oh, boy. Right. And right. before we go any further and actually do this, we need to explain the rules to the audience because you get this yeah, panel right. with it. Okay. Yeah. So you, you destroy the one chip challenge if you eat the one chip and don't consume any other thing for five minutes. Now, we have provided a caveat at Zoobox that you can consume as much hard liquor as you like in that five minutes. Though it is probably going to work against you, as every spicy food guide will tell you. Um, so, but it, it, this doesn't apply to Sue Box. Just because we make it to five minutes doesn't mean we get the paper. The last man standing gets, mm -hmm. the, gets the paper. The yeah. other two have to tear it up. And personally, I got my fireplace right here. If if you know what, if I don't earn it, I'm gonna burn it. Okay, yep. you're gonna be like a little different at Sue Box. You're going to be like the real Lebowski, and you're going to be like standing next to your fireplace watching it burn. Real men cry, too. Mm -hmm. Real That's men right. cry, too. I probably will be crying and vomiting in front of the fire. Oh, yeah. I, I fully expect to have tears running down my face, uh, my fat Irish face. Paul, do you have a uh, something to wipe your brow, my friend? I have rope paper towels and right, a hoodie. Cool. <laughs> I actually uh, I bleached the toilet in my bathroom today just to make sure in case I have to stick my face in there. It's all nice and clean. Ready to go. <laughs> yeah, because you don't. That's never good. Like you know, when you go in there, you're already like you're already sick. You're feeling like you're in a puke because you've had too much to drink. Your stomach sours, and then you go in there and it smells like shit. So you, oh, it's not good. It's not good. All right, gentlemen, are we ready? Um. Yeah. Is anyone else? Uh... 
got any uh, last words? Uh, no, I am happy. I, I am. I am safe. I'm tucked into a table full of uh, things that can help me if I am ready to die. Lots of various foods. So yes. I'm, I'm ready to go. Um, Theo, I love. I love you so much. Uh, I love un- you, son. To my unborn child, I love you. Also, theoretically, haven't met you yet, but I, I love you. Also. Yeah, for all you know, I could, same thing here. For all I know, my my son Ronan could be a total piece of shit, and I would regret it forever if this is the last thing I ever said. What if he? What if I do this, die, and he grows up and becomes a serial killer? Woo! You have to blame the Spice King on that. Yeah, yeah, yeah you will. Which is going to be me. Uh, okay, right. so. It's a fairly, it's a good size chip as we've seen on uh, various videos. What I'm going to do is I'm going to snap and stack myself. Oh yeah, it's like cardboard. Yeah, these chips have probably been sitting in a warehouse for three years. <laughs> well, it says 2021 on the packaging, so I mean, which means it was produced in like 2019. <clears throat> <laughs> oh man, did you get a wolf of that? You got a wolf of that. Oh yeah, a little bit, little little scent. Well, uh, you got a timer, Dan, right? Yes. Um, give me one second. I'm preparing my chip. I think I'm also going to use the uh, snap the, and stack. Snap, snap and stack. Yes. TM Zoo Box. Okay, that's my phrase, Spice King. If you would like to use that, I will be requiring yeah, uh, money. You- you need about twenty five thousand dollars if you want to be. Yeah. yeah, I need about. I'm telling, at least. I'm telling you right now. I'm telling you right now. I already feel it in my eyes. It's just like beaming <laughs> off the trip, like coming up, in me, like, right. um, <laughs> like I, this automatically, like all the shit talk prior, you know, like with the blue talkies. Like I, I'm, I already hate you guys. <laughs> all right, boys, you ready? Yep. Here we go. Hold on a second. I got to be ready to start this timer. My cell phone is not cooperating. It, it even doesn't want me to eat this. It's like you won't be able to pay your bill next month. <laughs> All right. Here we go. Three, two, one, go. So weird seeing you guys chew, too. It's like a Dorito. You know, um, it's not. It's not like a Dorito at all. Mm. Boy, I got a little in my teeth. A little in my gums. Whoa! <laughs> I'm glad I trimmed my mustache prior to this. Yeah, probably a good idea. Hey, let me guys ask you something. Uh, you guys see uh, the hot new Matrix flip film? Matrix Resurrections? Have yeah, I did. It was, uh, it was actually pretty interesting. <laughs> I liked it. It was pretty good. <laughs> yeah, see, I, liked- I liked the first 40 minutes of it. But then it kind of got into this weird place <laughs> where it reminded me why I hated the second and third part <laughs> of the trilogy. Yeah. <laughs> it's almost- That's what I thought. It kind of just squanders all the good that it does setting up the, uh, like the meta, <laughs> the, meta, <laughs> the meta nature. It squanders all that because then it becomes a formulaic, like kind of bullshit sci-fi movie. And all of the good work that it did <laughs> just completely gets squandered and it just becomes very for- formulaic. I mean, going back to like a Zion type place. Whatever the fuck the new place was called. Yeah. A complete goddamn waste of time. A complete fucking waste of time. It is. I always thought like the Zion is better it's better used as a metaphor, right? Especially if you don't see it. Yeah. And you spent back when we saw the first one, even with me and Profit were high as fuck at IMAX in Boston. It, it, that still didn't save it, you know? I mean oh, I, yeah. I'm with you, buddy, but I mean, fuck. You, you didn't need to see it. It was too on the nose. You didn't. You didn't need that. You didn't need that. But I do like the setup of it being kind of a critique of the legacy of the Matrix, uh-huh. and like what it's meant to culture. Yeah, it was pretty funny. Society. It was a nice parody. Well, too many franchises could do that, right? 
it was so cool about the first 40 minutes of it because they played all that meta sense of it. it yeah. Oh, yeah. Did that. <laughs> I just want to say, guys, I'm feeling hot, hot, hot. I'm not feeling this ship at all. It's a real spicy. <laughs> it's, a, it's a sweet ship. You guys ship. like music? Yeah. I like music. Yeah, I like to dance. It's no more reaction. Sweet, it's more no reaction. Sweet, there's no reaction. So far. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah, it's a sweet chip, all right. It's like, yeah, it's like uh, <sighs> sweet chili spice Doritos. Oh, yeah. <sighs> yeah, I'm glad I ate all those fucking <sighs> blue Takis. Yeah, dude. I mean, seriously. It's like, it tastes like Satan's pussy. <sighs> you know what I'm saying? <laughs> like his big <laughs> fat <laughs> pussy. <laughs> 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 So I feel like my ear. If you get it in your ears, I no. feel like it's boiling the. Uh, <laughs> my ears. Is your brain on fire? Out. Hey, your brain's on yeah. fire, dude. Minute thirty seconds, boys. You got brain burn, buddy. You may want to go see a doctor. Yeah. You may want to go see Joe Rogan. See if he's got any horse pace for your fucking stupid ass. Yeah. Joe Rogan. Joe Rogan. Joe Rogan. Joe Rogan. <laughs> Yeah, you guys hear what Joe Rogan said about black people? Holy shit, huh? One minute. You guys, what's okay? Hey, what's the best Terminator movie? Terminator Two. Any furlough if you're out there before I die? I would you come on Zoo Box? Talk about your great performance in Terminator Two. You know, <laughs> <laughs> Keep sending time. messages on the gram. Eddie. Please, buddy. Eddie, like, you, we want to do a career retrospective, and if you want us to eat the fucking chip while we do it, we'll fucking we do it, brother. We, we need a whole bag we of chips, dude. Eat your arm, Eddie. We need a whole bag of chips. It'll be me, you, and that lobster you stole from that grocery store that one time. Oh, what a funny story, Eddie. You set that shit Can we free. talk about and Wicked Prayer free. for 90 minutes? <sighs> I want to talk about that movie when you were in jail. You had to drink your own throw up, which is what I'm going to have to do in about 10 minutes. <laughs> Oh man, no. Detroit Rock City, baby! I want to talk about Tweed. I want to talk about those. Oh, shit. Shannon Tweed. Yeah. Ten seconds. Uh, Shannon, Shannon Tweed was like she's like a, one of those basic cable, fucking softcore porn goddesses. Yeah, yeah, just like likes for days. Like no fucking. reaction, no reaction, no reaction, no reaction, no reaction. It's like uh, <laughs> yeah. clearing up, uh, clearing Clear out your ears, sinuses. This is like this is like COVID, you know. I cured COVID with the Packy One Chip. Humiliation. <laughs> hey. hey. <laughs> oh, boy. Oh, look at me, boy. Oh. I'm, not oh, the oh, I'm the first boy. one that's going to flip. If we, ever get, if we ever get tortured for information, <laughs> I'm going to be the first one that's going to flip. <laughs> First one. Oh, there we go. I oh, got a little man. buzz, a little lightheaded. I do. I do feel like I, uh, I'm riding on something right now. Like riding on life. Like riding on 30 bananas on my way through Queensland. <sighs> About ready to debate. Oh, yeah. If everybody out there, if they, they want to know, we're going to be uh, debating vegan health enthusiast Durian Ryder, the inventor of. Uh-huh. Of the 30, uh, 30 banana a day diet. Turn rider. Hey, turn rider. I know you're out here, mate. I know you're out here. I can smell you. Smell like sweaty life for me. That's what it smells like. Oh, I can smell you out here. I want you on zoo box, though. I don't want you out here, mate. Come to me, zoo box there. Come on, come on, mate. That's right. I want to debate veganism with you. I want to debate the ethics of it. I want to debate the morality. I want to debate the sustainability. I want to debate the nutritional value. I want to debate. I just want to have you on here, mate. I want to have you talk about your lifestyle. Talk about your choices. I want you to convince these people that I'm a big fat slob, mate. He uh he's uh he's a he's a he's quite a prince. He's a mensch. <laughs> you know, there were gonna be a lot of that. A lot of crying from Durian Ryder. A lot of tears gonna be shed when we pwn his fucking banana. 
Sweet. If I didn't have milk, I wouldn't have been able to survive. <laughs> <laughs> All I want is a Q-tip right now. Oh, do you? Get that out, yeah. I'm going to keep this for a listen to fire. You can't go up. You can't get up. <sighs> I know. I know. So I, didn't get, think, get, I didn't think, Sean. It was going to be like digging through uh, my ears. Bunch up, bunch up some paper towel and use it like a Q-tip. Yeah, I can do the pen. But it's okay. But yeah, Matrix, man. Matrix. I like the first 40 minutes and the last of it was just kind of like it's kind of like uh, represent the uh, the trilogy at large if you think about it. Well, yeah. Well, it's the represent- first half and the second half was just like filler and disappointing. Yeah, I mean they had some cool ideas even towards the end. I like the the thing where like the agents can kind of the program can kind of take over anybody and they're like dive bombing at Neo and Trinity, like they're dive bombing them as they're on the motorcycle at the end, just like crunk crunk. crunk. I will say though, uh, and I've heard some weird defenses of it: the fight sequences, the set pieces, awful, awfully choreographed, awfully directed, and yeah. people are like, well, they do that on purpose, dude. It's like meta. That's part of the meta. I was what? like, I don't buy it. But no, me neither. Because if they wanted to be meta, they would have made it badass, like nineteen ninety eight badass. Yeah, actually, yes, it would have turned into a PS one game. Really make you fucking coom, dude. Oh, dude, I've been cooming for days. <laughs> I've been cooming for days, right, now. dude? I'm already coomed twice from this chip. I. I feel like it's coming out of my ears, dude. I think I'm gonna have to take this chip from now on every time I want to fucking come. I think, <laughs> I think at the end of every cold, I'm popping in one of these chips. Yeah, it's gonna clear you right the fuck detox. out. Detox. Whew. <laughs> 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 hey, crackhead Stanley, what you doing? <sighs> I heard you bought a concrete business. <laughs> he's so hot that he's got cold. Oh my god, cold chills. Thank you, Dan. Oh, now I'm feeling it a little bit. Yeah, I'm feeling Ooh. that tingle in the body. What level is that? Yeah, I'm glad we're semi on the same same weight there. Time check, mate. <clears throat> uh, <laughs> we've been going. Oh shit. What time do we start? I don't know. We're about ten minutes in, I would say. Yeah, you're gonna have to uh the alarm went off, so you're gonna have to do the time check for, like the replay. <laughs> Oh god. So, let me oh, see I'm so here. weak. I'm so weak. <laughs> oh, Dan, you god. were right away, dude. I couldn't, dude. I would. I was. Listen. <laughs> I was reaching for my milk before it was even over. I was like putting my hand on my milk for strength. <laughs> oh. so, I think we're definitely. We're probably on a vision disruptor. Well, we, we passed. We passed five game? minutes. Yeah, we're past five minutes. That's the spicy punch. Okay. Right? Okay. Where are the five minutes? Powerless. Ten minutes. Powerful. Thirty minutes. Supercharged. Okay. One hour. Invincible. All right. Hey, you know I, what? I saw at the end of the five minutes, it was like 938. So we're, we're ten minutes in. We're ten minutes in. We have to go to 1038 to get to hit the hour. Oh, man. Let's react to something. With Axel. <laughs> it's a night for kings, everybody. <coughs> oh. oh, man. Oh, man. This is the video that they like show children before they're ushered into Illuminati sex dungeons. They're like, yo, watch this. Watch Terry freak the fuck out. I know, man. No, that does check out. That's that's exactly exactly what they show those kids. All right, what's up? I don't deserve whiskey. <laughs> <laughs> well, you know what I do deserve? It's more of this fucking ice cream. Oh man. <laughs> um I, I, cool. I want you to get that close up because I don't know how we're gonna react to this. What, so we, okay, so we've what, gone. What, what's the science behind this shot? We've gone, Why we've can't gone, you have whiskey with this going on? We've gone fifteen minutes. So fifteen minutes puts us. Okay, so there is no category for fifteen minutes. It goes from five to ten to thirty to one hour. Now, 
Do we want to wait for 30 minutes? Before we can reward ourselves with some with wild whiskey? Drinking? I mean, I got... Let me see here. So we we're 15 minutes in. Yeah. Roundabout, I think. I feel like I should like uh, mute my camera so you guys don't have to see me eating all this ice cream. No, 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 no. You're fine. No, it's, uh, it's actually Dan, very grateful because I just want to get my Ben and Jerry's tub. Yo, I, I'm, a, I'm a fucking Spice King, Dan. I think it's official now. I think you shut the fuck up from forever. <laughs> Don't talk to me, son. I'm a kid. <laughs> yeah. I'm all like cowering. <laughs> oh, man. I'm just going to hunt you down on the internet, and every time you refer to yourself as a Spice King, I, I don't find think you. so, buddy. I will find you. <laughs> Uh, so if you wanted to wait till you got supercharged at the supercharge mark, that's when you start the other chip. Oh, okay. If you want to get really fucking wacky, okay. Well, I feel like if you front load, like those those people did too. You know what I mean? Like then. Listen, I'll tell you what. I think the snap and stack. I think that was a fucking clutch was, idea. Yeah. Because you got it down a lot faster than you would have if your mouth had to like move it around and break it apart. <clears throat> Snap and, yeah. snap and stack, everybody. That's going to be my t-shirt, Spice yeah. King. Okay? Yeah. Well, did you guys snap feel like snap. you were just chewing forever? Yeah. Yes, yeah. and this is something, you know, and I'm going to be fair. This is something I criticized almost every video I watched. I was like, why aren't you just swallowing? But the chip is so dry. Right. And so, like, cardboard. It's, like, chewy. You know? And it probably that's probably because it's been, like, dancing in a warehouse for fucking two years. Oh, yeah. shit. What you doing to me, man? That Willem Dafoe. <laughs> <laughs> That's a young, early Willem Dafoe role. This is also this is Henry Cavill's father. You know. I see the resemblance. Hello. You think he does dad me, twenty minutes a day? Or do you think he's at that thirty mark? Fucking thirty in the morning. No, this dude isn't ripped enough. How many? He's not ripped enough to, for what? I'm talking. I'm thinking he's probably like a 15, 20 banana guy, day guy. Oh. Look at those delts, man. Yeah, but he'll, yeah. He'll, he'll be way more vascular if he's eating all those bananas. I think that he actually eats a lot of animal fat because he's kind of chubby if you look at him. Yeah, when chubby. you really start to think about it, this guy's a fat piece of shit. Yeah, whatever. Maybe chubby in that D. Did you see him laying rolling? Down? Keep Did you see rolling. him laying down with that twink in that bed? This guy is <laughs> fucking cut like out of stone. Out. Well, you guys are talking. You guys are crazy. Okay, give me your password. My password? Out with it. Oral cum shot. <laughs> Oral cum shot. Yeah, that fits. <laughs> I mean, that's a pretty good password. I mean, who's gonna guess that? I mean, well, now I have to change all my passwords because yeah. it's fucking out yeah. there. <laughs> I've just, just been done. There's some numbers, you know, uppercase and special characters, you know, and you got it, you got it made. You got it made. I just got doxxed by fucking Catalinaville. <laughs> what the <laughs> fuck? <laughs> what the fuck? Oh, uh, watch the full moon movie at links in the description below. Uh, wow. Tempting. Get tempting. you right at that cliffhanger, man. I can't believe you guys are still going. I mean, I can't uh, believe that Sean did pull up the full clip and just that tease. Like, what the hell? What the yeah, hell? why don't we see some uh, ass to ass? What's going on? <laughs> right? <laughs> I want to see some shit for real, dude. What's Give us an update, Prophet. How are we feeling? Uh, indigestion. I'd say that uh, the. The two thirds of a pint of Ben and Jerry's, the more than a quart of milk, uh, and the five pop tarts I've eaten only have made it, it has only made it feel like I just ate an entire bag of Takis at once. <laughs> really that bad for you? Damn, buddy. I mean, it comes, it hits me a little bit every once in a while. Like I'll feel like a residual, like when I swallow or my saliva mixes around in my mouth. Yeah, kind of reactivate something, and I'm starting to feel. I feel a little, a little heat in my tummy right now. 
Yeah, yeah. No, it's like uh, it's it's dropping. Yeah, you, yeah, like you can feel it. Like, you can feel it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. <sighs> so what's fucking me up is that I want a cigarette really, really bad. So I'm going ape on this stupid thing, <laughs> but from my lips, it's going onto this you know, device. So every time I'm doing it, it burns. So Paul, like, yeah, Paul, just do it. Yeah, just do it, dude. You own the house. It's fine. You can't just kick you it. out of your own house, Paul. <laughs> <laughs> Whose name Good is on stuff. the deed, Paul? Well, you want to lick the bag or what? Yeah, let's give it a go, man. Oh, fuck it, dude. Yeah. Ready? Uh, oh, fuck. Oh, that's all oil. Fucking retards. Whoa! <laughs> <laughs> that was... Oh, shit. Oh, we had oh, to up the game, Dan. We had oh, to up the game. Oh, shit. Oh, shit. Oh, shit. Oh, shit. Are you serious? Is he serious? <laughs> no, because it's like if you look in the bag, it's the, all the oily. Uh, right? Yeah, yeah, it's all the shit. Uh, the Surrender. Hey, no, Surrender. Fucking through the roof of my mouth. Surrender, my queen. <laughs> I'm getting a little residual shock right now. Yeah, it's, it's like it's it's the oil. Yeah, well, dude, it, like, well, right at the roof of my mouth, that's where I fucked up. How's your glove looking? You got spice on your glove? Should we suck the spice off the glove? Smell yeah. the glove, mate. <laughs> I feel like such a coward. <laughs> dude, you made five minutes, so you did. So I think you made, you did that what you had to do. Yeah, you went five you minutes, you, Dan. You did what you had yeah. to do. When, when you go back and cut the footage, you'll see me ripping my Ben and Jerry's open at, like, 4.45. Like, I'm <laughs> ready to tear into that shit. Oh shit! All right, I got my thumb here. You good, Sean? Yeah, I got some right here. He's literally <laughs> sucking the juices. Off <laughs> <the chair. laughs> fucking, you look like you're fucking sucking on an old condom, you piece so, of shit. So this reminds me of like two things. One, when uh, we were kids and we used to go rummage through your dad's ashtray. Like, oh man, this one's got like you yeah. know a quarter of an inch left. Yes. Yeah, yeah, right. <laughs> And then that other thing where, you know, we really scraped the table and make sure we got all the residuals left. But yeah, I'll leave that alone. Yeah, yeah. Holy oh, shit. Hey, there's a Roscoe. The clown. Oh, man. Okay. You get in there. See it. Look at it. You get some. So I'm tr- I got some right here. here. Yeah, I do. I have some yeah. right here on my, my glove there. Oh, boy. Just make sure this one doesn't go to the roof of my mouth. Oh. Hey, Sean, why don't you shove it up your nostril, huh? You want you want to do nostril shot, man? Is that what you want to do? Is that, is that where you want to take this? Hey, Sean, you know. <laughs> hey, you want to just stick it up your fucking ass, buddy? Come on. Are you a king? I got inspired, I got inspired by the Catalina, the Catalina floppy drive, okay? Yeah. Those you guys, guys are just, can take it. You're like taking toothpicks and dipping it in the oil and sounding with it. You're just sticking it up your urethra. It's just fucking. <laughs> I would need ah, to absorb yeah. it through every orifice. You know? All right, here we go. I'm going. Ready? Okay. Okay. I suck at my thumb. Oh, you guys are. <gasps> I didn't realize that kings uh, can uh, act uh, like uh, such paupers. Uh, <laughs> uh, I crush your head. I crush your head. Do it. Again. Do it. The fuck you do? Try to throw it away? Try to hide your shame? You know how I know Sean's the spice king? Because he told you to lick the bag and you did it. <laughs> Huh? What'd you say, Dan? I said, you know how I know Sean's the Spice King? Because he told you to lick the bag and you did it. <laughs> no, he said, go get your bag. I was like, show him. I thought he was calling me out. No, I am calling you out. I got a, I got another <laughs> finger of Spice. And we got you got to at least do something. If I'm gonna, okay. oh, you, know what? you know what, Paul? Throw it away. Throw it away in the trash. No, 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 I'll no, just, no. I'm going to okay. suck these no, fingers I got, dry, I got baby. I got some more here on this side. All, All right. right. You know what? I'm going to follow you. I'll do both. I got some stuff here. Maybe I might have a little why, bit more. Why, why are you giving me sass for not having a dirty glove as you have? <laughs> Ready? You're like, you know, I, yeah. God damn it. Dude, because uh, we got to, this got to be, somebody's got to fail. Somebody's got to be crowned king here, and it's not me. <laughs> okay. Ready? Yeah. Oh. <laughs> Holy shit. Now this is just a TV show for me. <laughs> Yeah, you're getting your own, your own little private situation. Just to give you guys an update on the uh, the pussy update, uh, I, I am. Uh, I'm currently there, feeling kind of sad. I'm currently, yeah, the, my sadness is the most intense feeling that I have. The uh, the spiciness has basically passed. <coughs> I feel like I might have just eaten a bag of uh, sweet lime uh, chili Doritos, 
but but mostly my stomach feels like I chewed about 700 sticks of gum and swallowed them all at once. It feels like there's a big block of rubber in my stomach right now. Okay, all that, all that milk. I think I saw you eat like uh, yogurt or some shit before. This. Yeah, it definitely has to do with a half gallon of milk and the uh, pint of Ben and Jerry's that I ate in a minute and thirty seconds. <laughs> I've never seen Dan. Honestly, I like you. You may have. You probably have the best reactions because you were clearly dying. Like you're like, <sighs> and you couldn't talk about the Matrix. You couldn't. Say I can't believe that like there wasn't a winner. It, it there was only just that I was the loser. <laughs> <laughs> kind of like. <laughs> Like now, but you know, I'll say this though. Now, when I watched that one last night with the hipster family, and that little kid only ate like a little teeny tiny morsel, and he was like spitting it out and dying. That kid's a fucking pussy, and that kid should be put in jail. <laughs> he should be sent to Saudi Arabia for whatever fifteen thousand dollars will get a prince these days. Fuck, like, fuck it. I'm getting Foster out of bed. I'm getting Foster out of bed right now. I'm gonna make him lick the inside of this wrapper. I'm gonna yeah. show the world that my kid's not a pussy. This is how we. This is how I win. <laughs> Every summer, but uh, Paul, uh, gut check. How's your guts feeling? Um, well, I'm glad you asked. I had another semi drop there. I feel like I won't know unless I like stand up. Does that make sense? Oh, Paul, right. stand up, dude. Uh, gotta stretch it out there, huh? <sighs> Fuck what a bitch like me. I don't think so. But yeah, man. Like, as you got, so they, are you, do you feel anything in your stomach? Not. Not really. Not, not, not really. Just like you know, we had that drop that we talked about a little bit. It's like a little unsettling. Yeah. But it's not like I got like punched or anything. Like. Now, what about you, Prophet? Like, how is uh, gut check? How's your guts doing? Um, you feel like your guts have been pushed in like summer rains by Chucky? No, I think that I I pre-gamed. I uh, uh, like it like the work. Like a guy going to Bill's sex house, I took my prep, and uh, I I got sprayed with a toxic load, but I'm still healthy. And, that's good. Uh, that's good to hear because that doesn't yeah. always happen when you get sprayed with a toxic load. Right. Um, that's not, that's something else Paul's never seen. By the way. Oh oh well, Paul's never seen Standard Fuck Party. We should bring it up right now. Ooh. Yeah, let's finish this song and I'll I'll go grab it. Uh, but to <laughs> answer. I don't have to fish the sock. All right, to, fine. To, to answer your question, I feel really normal. I think that I, I pre-gamed really well, and I post-gamed really well, and I tapped out really early, so that all helped. Yeah. We got shit to do tomorrow. Yeah, here it is. This is a little short clip. This is from this is from a larger documentary that I actually watched the entire thing of. Um, this is when Nightcap was actually this was very early days of Nightcap. This was another a prophet shadow producing. He would just like drop videos on Facebook Messenger, like watch this. <laughs> and then I found the whole documentary. It was a very exciting night for me. Before we get into the clip, are we going to finish Summer Rain or get into the? No, we we uh, Paul vetoed Summer Rain. I don't know uh, what his problem is. He's kind of fucking, can't he's, he's a little cunty. Probably can't handle how cute she is. He probably um, can't. He's just jealous, dude. Look at him. He's like, he doesn't want to like keep his boner. Well, which this video is not going to help with because you're definitely going to keep your boner. Because uh, you probably got maybe you got some spicy oil on your fingers and you're like, I don't want to touch it. Yeah, you definitely want to wear gloves before you go to Bill's sex house. You don't want to get any of those spicy oils in any crevices. <laughs> no. But before we watch this clip, I want to preface it by saying there's another clip. If anybody's out there and is watching this and knows where this other clip is, please send it to Zoobox because I've been looking for it. It's been scrubbed from the internet, and I've been looking for it. There's another clip of Bill, Sex House Bill, Standard Fuck Party Bill, talking about the process of making gay porn. And he's got, like, files and files and files of gay porn. And he's like, well, we film the scenes, and then when we, we use uh, all the extra stuff to make behind-the-scenes footage that we put on the website. So it's, it's kind of like slaughtering a hog. You use the whole thing. Is, and he, isn't, isn't, he, isn't that part of the same documentary? It's. I don't think it's in the documentary, and that's why okay. I can't find it. Um, I actually think I watched the entire documentary to look for it and never found it. Okay. But if anybody is out there uh, with Bill and the clip of him comparing filming gay porn to slaughtering a hog, I would love to see that <laughs> clip again. 
Well, we actually call that the fuck you. The Southern Baptists wouldn't take too kind of that, but uh, you know, it's made exactly the right height so the bottom boys can get on it and the tops do their thing. So we designed it and uh, it's been pretty popular. Oh, yeah, like casually as he's just like this got a cigarette hanging out, his fucking fat slob. Just a tr- just looks like a like a gross deviant. Yep. <laughs> it's yep. like you know you got them bottom boys and you just kinda pop up there and you drill them. You know you mm-hmm. drill them. <laughs> just fill them with your hot viral load. They want it. They want it bad. <laughs> and I will give it to them. You know, I think we did. We're about an hour ten. All right, gentlemen. Cheers. Oh wait, 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 wait. <sighs> we Let's went an hour happened. we went an hour ten? Yeah. Okay. Well, so this is no. This is supposed. To, <laughs> this is supposed to fuck us up, right? If we no, I have no. I don't know if it will. I don't know. Is there any videos of people doing a shot after they do the one chip challenge? Uh, there is no. There is no. Or there doing no. having a drink, anyways. Yeah. Salute. Salute. So it's the first thing we drank in a, over an hour and ten minutes. Yeah. Oh, it's okay. From, from the trip. It's nice. Hold on. Let's see what happens. I'm going to give it a second. As it travels down inside of me, I'm like one of those guys in like those those like Imodium commercials. You just see the, the whiskey running down. Yeah. Like catching up to the fire. Yeah, I still have what a what left over from the, the norm shit. Oh, shit. So that's what I'm messing around with here. I got a... Uh, oh, he's got Wild Turkey 101. There we go, Dan. I don't say thing. Well, I got the, I got have a hundred proof rye. I wasn't able to get to the liquor store. Sorry. No, you're fine. Well, you wouldn't want to have good stuff with the wood chip. That's why I pulled out the turkey. It's Ooh. okay. Oh, well, that's a little warm. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. You, you you felt? I just felt it was yeah. like warm rumble. Yep. Yeah. Ooh, ooh. Let's say you king. No, fossil alarm. No. We're gonna be here. <laughs> We're gonna be here for six more fucking hours. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Let's start the fellowship of the rig right now. Start to end. Let's do it. Extended editions. None of that no. pussy theatrical version shit. No. I'm gonna start like a, a Amazon. Oh no, I'm gonna start like Uber eating you guys like the spiciest food from your <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I have to sit there mukbanging it all night. Meanwhile, I'm like the guy. Uh, I'm like the guy on Titanic who like hopped into the lifeboat as like they were lowering the women and children down. I'm the dude who like he dressed hustled, up as a woman. And and then one of the uh, <laughs> one of the one of the guys who's loading uh, the people on the lifeboat says like "lady on the left," and he looks over and it's the dude. And they both <laughs> they both look at each other in shame as the lifeboat gets lowered down. And then there's there, there's a shot later in the movie. Uh, as as the boat is sinking, the dude like looks back, and then he like looks down in shame, and that's that's me. And very very challenge. <laughs> that's the Cameron touch there. He's just like, oh, if you if you hadn't figured it out before, these guys are embarrassed, but they're yeah. happy to be alive. You and you and uh, you and Paul Paul and Sean are, are literally both the captain clutching to the wheel of the ship as the water explodes <laughs> and fills the cabin. You guys you might be a, like might. the vi- like the violinist said, like one last yeah, song. You got, yeah, you got yeah, you got to play one last song <laughs> as the ship goes down. Yeah. Meanwhile, I'm like surrounded by women and children, like I'm fucking shivering. I, I really commend you guys for hanging in there. There could be no end to your endurance. Like you yes, we did it. But it's just like like airy. Yeah, like, the whiskey. So the, yeah, the whiskey. Yeah, whiskey like, a, do you I feel like you. air pockets? I just feel a deep sense of discomfort right now. Yeah. No, I feel like someone will buy just for. Uh, I feel like I felt like uh, when I, I when I ate the habaneros, and then like forty minutes later, I was like, "Oh, I'm fine." And so I drank like half of a bang, and then uh, I felt like I was gonna die. I had to drink it, and then I drank a glass of milk like immediately, and it was I was fine. Yeah, and I wasn't really sure what was going on or what you guys. No, were you were clearly in some like wild fucking pain, doing everything you could yeah, to maintain he was. composure. <laughs> like. As soon as I saw you, like not like you were making me laugh, and you know, because I'm trying to get you to talk about the Matrix, and you're not doing it, and I'm just like repeating the same thing over and over again. And Paul's repeating the same point over and over again. 
as we're trying to make our way, like make make a review. <laughs> yeah, my, I I completely shut down. My uh, my brain started to collapse on itself. I mean, it was like in the scenes in Lawnmower Man when he's like in the VR simulation. I was like. It was like, like everything was just on fire, and I was just like <laughs> going through cyberspace with my hands out. In front. <laughs> I need to escape to this diseased mainframe. That's uncomfortable. Oh yeah, yeah. How uncomfortable, Paul? Which side is it on? Are you going into VTech? It's like both sides. Now, Paul, I can tell you if you just if you go get yourself a glass of milk, Paul, like you're probably gonna feel better like immediately. This is, a, this is a weird psychological long game. Listen, I'll wait. tell you what, dude. You can go. I will. If you. Yeah, will you can, on your honor, Paul. On your yeah. honor. Go get yourself a glass of milk and come back down on your fucking honor. Uh-huh. On your honor. In your children's life. Their <laughs> lives. He's like, like, that's going to do something. Okay. <laughs> yeah. okay. okay. He's like, been okay, trying buddy. I've been trying to make it look like an accident for 12 years. Okay. So, uh, okay. <laughs> Yeah, what, wait, what do I have to do? What are you saying? You can go get a glass of milk if you just, like, I'll, okay. I'll, I'll, I'll hold you. I'll, no, no, you know, it's You're fine. an honorable man, right? No, not it's really. fine. No, I know you're fine. not. I it's know fine. you're not. <laughs> oh, okay. okay. What is this weird gaslighting that Sean is doing? He's just playing games. This is, this is like watching Arnold and uh, Franco eat breakfast. Sean, it and just kills iron. you that... I'm not. I told. Listen, I had said. I think on the stream last night, I said you're a dark horse. You're a dark horse. I knew you would be. I knew you were going to go past five minutes. I knew you would. I, I, didn't, uh, I, I Dan was Dan. I think Dan was freaking himself the fuck out. <laughs> and also, That's listen. Good. Here's my here's my here's my thing going into it. I was like, I've already been through enough pain recently. I'm not putting myself through more of this shit. I'm gonna hang in there with my brothers. If if I'm feeling it, I'll hang in there a little longer. But I'm pretty sure I'm gonna tap out. Like so I think you're right. I think I tap. I think I psyched myself out. But the other part of it is that uh, I just I have nothing to prove, man. I have nothing to prove. <laughs> I'm not really the spice king. I I knew as soon as you ordered the chips that I was going to be exposed. <laughs> for a yeah. fucking fraud. Yeah. <laughs> I knew that it was it was then or never. And so I just said, listen, I'm gonna buy myself a bunch of ice cream and milk and I'm gonna embarrass myself in front of everybody. And now now I'm no longer the spice king. I can literally no longer put up any spice king. Like Russian troops <laughs> should carry this shit in the winter. Yeah. Because I can literally feel the warmth moving through my digestive system. Yeah. <laughs> That's no, what like, it's, it's pretty crazy. It's not uncomfortable. It's just I can feel like the warmth moving through. It. Yeah, no, I'm yeah. I'm sweating inside this hood. Well, I think it's more from the turkey. Near the tail looks end like uh, looks like Captain Dad over here is having a great time in his Hawaiian shirt. He's laughing. He's giggling. He's got like a what is that? A zombie? Is that a tiki drink he got? He's yeah, well, always yeah. been. He has always been a better actor, a better performer. <laughs> always at the surface level, but deep down inside, I know what a sad, sad. <laughs> Sorry, little man. Sean is. It's going to be, it's it's gonna be four o'clock in the morning, and Sean's going to be like, "Paul, you want to go upstairs? You want to get a drink? You want to get a drink?" Buy, <laughs> sell, sell. As regards to the one chip challenge, how are we going to tie this up here? I don't know. I don't know. I mean, we're I, supposed to have a big reveal with this poster. I, personally, I feel like this is unresolved. I think that you guys need to call a draw and come back next year. So, Sean, how about this? What's up? We both destroy until 2022. Until the new chip comes out? All right. Whoa, 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 whoa. What? 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 I'm still in the running? You can come back. Yeah. yeah. I mean, there's you're always going to have an asterisk. There's nothing you can do about that. <laughs> There's always going to be an asterisk next year when, if you come back in 2022. But not only Paul, not only did we 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 destroy, we literally destroyed the poster, destroyed the challenge. We still haven't had anything to drink except for hard alcohol. Yeah. Well, yeah. So I had eight ounces of Wild Turkey 101 at the hour mark. After we hit the hour and ten mark, now yeah. like I feel like I I do feel like I got punched in the gut. 
Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Big tub. Steel toes. Yeah. Steel toes. But if we yeah. didn't call it here, we would be this would go on all it would go no, on we, forever. We, we would just we would just keep this going. Yeah. I think maybe it's just we're too used to just being just dicks. Uncomfortable and being dicks. Mm-hmm. <laughs> We eat enough weird shit that you're used to your stomach feeling a little off, you know? Yeah. Yeah. But I, honestly, I think that burger in uh, Atlanta was worse than that. Really? Mm-hmm. You think the, the Carolina Reaper burger was worse? Mm-hmm. I don't know. Maybe it was the bite, like the particular bite I had where I, it was like poor CD. But I, like, there's a, there's a moment on that burger where I thought I was going to chug. Really? Yeah. yeah. Oh, okay. Okay. Well, you know, I didn't have that reaction, but, you know. <laughs> but I did already rip the poster up. I guess we could have settled it there. Be like, well, well, you know, some of us, some people are just a little more uh, resilient than others, you know? Uh, God, until 2022. Or maybe, hey, you think, hey, you, you can be the spice cake, but now you don't have the poster. <laughs> have fun taping it back up, <laughs> asshole. I don't even need it now. Now it's just to say, fuck <laughs> you. Things happening, everybody. Well,. Thank you for watching. Uh, this is because we're going to post the raw video and we are posting. Uh, there'll be an edited version as well, which will be the fun, just like crazy reaction uh, part portions. But yeah, that's the one chip challenge for 2021. Um, Spice King, Spice King, let me tell you something. Step up your game. Uh, step up your game. <laughs> yeah, Dan, hide your fucking face. <laughs> just fucking hide it. <laughs> But that was the Spice King challenge. You know, I think now, uh, you know, a king has not been crowned. King has not been fucking crowned, but, but it ha- the challenge was destroyed. It was destroyed. Now I'm starting it to think was. the Spice King is just a joke. This guy, he's a, he's, he's a faker. Yeah. Okay? All right. that's, the, that's the thing. You know what? Right? We go back to. I challenge the Spice King to a fucking debate. Oh, shit. What? I challenge the Spice King to a debate. And no. We have to eat these chips no. while we're doing the debate. Ooh. We're going to be. What are you going to debate? About, what are you going to debate him on? I want to debate him about abortion. <laughs> <laughs> I want to debate you about abortion. You, uh, you pick whatever side you want, buddy. I'll take. I'll take the opposite side. That's. I don't care. I just. It has got to be the hottest fucking debate on the planet. <laughs> One chip challenge chips. Abortion. Let's go. Let's fucking go. Like I said, I'll take either side. Either side. I got good arguments for both. God. Well, that's, a, that's an open challenge. We got to get the word out to Cam. Paul, you got to get on it. Got to yep. get, get Spice King on the horn. Got to get on that list. We're going to be spamming his Instagram account uh, within the next 10 hours. Mm. All right, everybody. Thank you so much for joining us. I'm Sean. I'm Dan, the not Spice King. (laughs) Big Paul, Spice King? Question mark. Question mark. (laughs) Thank you for watching. And we'll see you next time on Zoobox. Welcome to the Hotel California. Such a lovely place. Such a lovely place. Such a lovely place. This is past and future guest Dan Prophet recording from the bathroom uh, the morning after the one chip challenge and uh, the fire shits are real. It was warm and tingly coming out. Um, now my sphincter is, it kind of feels like there was a heating pad, like there was a hot hands on my sphincter all night. And uh, it's not, it's, it doesn't hurt, but it's uncomfortable and it's real. And I want you to know. Here's the kid. All right, okay. later. Hello, Pablo. You made me so proud. You made me so proud that that one chip challenge. Good, 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 good. On.